I do. All right. This one shouldn't be too bad because now if I said this is my x1 and y1 in uh, the distance formula, I'd have the square root of 12. And this would be minus some value. We're going to square that. And then I got the negative square root of 7. We'll subtract something from that and square that as well. Now my uh, x1 value is 0. I'm sorry, my x2 and my y2 is 0. So this comes out really nice because now when I subtract 0 from these, I just get the same thing, right? So I got the square root of the square root of 12, which I'm going to square. And I'm going to add that to the negative square root of 7, which I will also square. And that gives me the square root of, uh, the square root of 12 squared is 12, plus the square root of negative 7, the square root of, neg of 7, the negative square root of 7 squared would be 7. Notice that one popped out as a positive because it gave us two negatives. So this gives us the square root of 12 plus 7, which is 19. That can be simplified any further because 19 is a prime number. And uh, the square root of 19 is approximately 4.35. I had 8, 9, so I'm just going to round it up to 9. So this is the answer it's looking for.